Now let's look at how to admit a patient using manual entry. As soon as the patient is connected, the Information Center displays and will save the physiological data. You must, however, admit the patient to the Information Center for the patient's name to appear on the display, on reports, or before you can transfer the patient. We can do this one of two ways. We can either click on the Manage Patient Shortcut button or we can just click on the patient's name and it will open the Manage Patient window. You'll see an asterisk next to all of the required fields. And then we enter the required patient demographic information. You'll want to identify the patient's gender from the drop-down list. If you're going to be performing any 12-lead EKG captures and a gender is not specified, the gender is going to default to male and it will not reanalyze. And if you'll be measuring STE and you've not specified a gender, the system is going to default to female to determine the alarm limits. Next, we're going to enter the patient's date of birth. You can utilize the calendar or you can enter the date numerically and the system will calculate the age for you. And then we'll select Apply. If the system's default pace mode is set to unconfirmed, a message is going to ask you to select On or Off. Verify that the patient category and the pace mode are both correct. And when we close the Manage Patient window, we can see that our sector has updated with our patient's name. And that's how we admit a patient using manual entry.